Robert Parsons to get the more on this. Rob, let's begin in the United States, maybe where wildfires are burning up large areas uh, across from California, Nevada, Oregon. They seem to be all the more common. Give us an idea of what's happening there now. Well, the, the situation is pretty awful. If you're 88 states at the moment of uh, uh, fighting forest fires. There are 22,000 firefighters involved in it. And in some of the states, you know, the, the fires are almost lighting up as soon as fires are extinguished elsewhere. Uh, you mentioned just now California. Uh, the, the, the governor there has declared a state of emergency in four districts in the north of the state. In Oregon, uh, the governor there, Kate Brown, said it was like being hit by a hammer on the head. Harsh reality is, she said, we're going to see more of these wildfires, hotter, more fierce, more challenging to tackle, and they're a sign of changing climate uh, impact. It's very hard to, to, to disagree with that. 560,000 hectares burning in the United States at the moment. That's a vast swathe of land. Indeed, and fires then in the US, but also we're seeing a similar picture all the way across in Russia, where, of course, smog there also uh, playing a heavy impact yeah. on the health of people. Absolutely. In Russia, in eastern Siberia, in the, in the taiga, the, the immense forests, which have such an important role to play in the health of the, the planet's air, uh, fires are burning across an even bigger space, three times bigger than the territory burning in the United States. Uh, in uh, the Sakha region, uh, particularly around the town of Yakutsk, 320,000 people regarded as the coldest city on the planet. Uh, temperatures rose by five degrees centigrade on average between January to June this year. Uh, and that the, the, the air quality is so awful now in uh, Yakutia, in Yakutsk, that they're saying it's 17 times worse than the average in the very worst polluted cities uh, in India and China, just to give a measure of how awful things are there. 1.5 million hectares on fire. Uh, and as I was saying at the beginning, the damage to everybody is immense because of the vital role that the taiga, like the Amazon forest, uh, the taiga plays a critical role in keeping our air quality high. Indeed, the Amazon now seems to be admitting more CO2 than it captures at current play. Robert, thanks for, indeed for that for now.